we're thrilled to have Arnold Hayskamp come tonight and talk to us about new developments in the research of, of cannabis and different medical conditions. So cannabis as a medicine. Uh, of course, I can tell you a long story that I believe in cannabis as a medicine, and it makes a lot of sense, but you probably also know people that say, well, if I drink three beers or three whiskeys, then my pain goes away too. So it's just all placebo. You just want to get high, and then you know, don't feel anything anymore. <clears throat> Maybe they're right. Who knows? This I, I always call the most important slide in my presentation because this actually links what we all observe and think we know about medicinal cannabis to the world of pharmacy because we actually have cannabis going on in our brain all the time. What does that mean? Well, in 1965, some guy called Mitchulam, he was then a PhD student in Israel, discovered the molecular formula of THC. I just showed it to you in one of my earlier slides. Of course, the question was, if we consume these molecules, something happens to our brain. So how does that work? What happens actually inside our body? It took 25 years to actually find receptors or binding places in our brain and immune system um, where cannabinoids, THC and others, had their activity. So that's where they go and that's where they start a certain reaction that gives us a certain effect. Then the question arises, what are these receptors doing here? They're not created by God just to give us a good time when we smoke cannabis. And maybe that's the case too. But there must be some other reason as well. So there must be something going on in our bodies. Some chemicals must be there that bind these receptors and have a function. And indeed, just five years later, they identified the so-called endogenous cannabinoids, or endocannabinoids, and these are two of the main ones, and then the mind of 2-AG. Um, and it means that our body is regulating a lot of its functions, everything from blood pressure to bone formation to um, regulating pain with these chemicals. What we're actually doing when we smoke cannabis as a medicine, we're interfering with the system to push it in the direction that we want to push it. Um, so there's a real link with what our bodies are doing um, and what cannabis does to it. <coughs> 